Best. I'm going to show you the machine control, how it works, and all the great features of iDig Best. Turn the system on here and we get started. We've got some really great features here. First is we've got the uh, level to show you the level of your machine and this will show you the angle of your bucket, how it's sitting. So if you're cutting an angle or anything, 45 degrees or 22, you can see the angle you're sitting to cut or you can see if you're sitting correctly. Now right now we're, our bubble's clear down here. We're about two and a half degrees um, out. It's 0.5 degrees per bubble. We've got a, a new uh, copyrighted uh, way to do machine control. We've got patents and this is really cool how this works. We've got a thing called match grade. Um, match grade is, is, is technically the, the most advanced way that machine control works. Match grade is right now our, our level, our Y, or our plane is zero. Uh, match grade will match that grade. So when I push the pedal, the bucket turns green, and the bucket rolls to match the grade. So now as I pull, you can see the bucket just matches the grade as we pull. Very simple. I let go of the pedal, it turns machine control off, it's on green. So as you can see, we're, we're back at the end. We've got the uh, LED lights, um, zero. Zeros are great. You can see the LED lights are solid on the, on the bucket down there. And I'd say, okay, I'm gonna dig a sewer at a certain grade and I'd put it a, a, a strong grade in. But we just hit the uh, button over here to the slope that we've got in and we can change it right now. I got a 40% uh, grade. Uh, normally it might be 1% or, or you can go to a hundredth of a percent, so no big deal. And you can see the slope and the grade, how it works there. So when I kick the pedal now, and I turn it on, it's gonna match that grade. So if you walk to the bucket, how it's aiming up there, and uh, we've got other features like balance, that's where it's rocking back and forth, or dig. Uh, once you get it in dig, you can see how it just follows that grade. So as we go up, it'll tell us how far away from the grade we are and what we're doing. So you can see it there in space, what's going on. Uh, match grade's very handy. So let's say we're back to a flat, flat basement or whatever we're doing. Uh, hit enter, boom, we're back to flat. If I just step on the pedal again, of course it goes right to that grade exactly as I pull it right to the grade. You can see the machine control working very well. We also have different things on here like speed, uh, dig, float. Uh, this is our ballast float that you'll turn on and off uh, to uh, control the main booms ballast. Uh, ballast means that when you pull back on the main boom, stick, you'll be making the bucket either lighter continuously or you'll push down to make it heavier. Uh, our system changes the dynamics of your excavator and it, and it detaches the boom cylinder basically in a way and turns it into a ballast so that now that it's more of a scissor action between boom one and two or the crowd in the main boom. Um, some of the other simple advantages are uh, our machine. This one right here is we hit the button, it flashes. It's the uh, hitch hoe, we call it. It's a, there's a back hoe we put on the back of a, a truck, and it's bucket one. You got up to nine buckets, 10 different machines. Uh, very simple. To add a bucket, it's real simple. Just click the menu, and you just add your name of bucket, and uh, it's about a one minute process to add a bucket. So, another thing I'm going to show you is called profiling um, with our automation of our dig control. Profiling is you just hold down the button again, which is for the slope. It's going to bring you into profiling. You can put up to four profiles. A profile is, uh, for example, if you had a, uh, a pool, a fiberglass pool, you could set it up on the ground and you could take the points um, and just hold your bucket to each point of the pool where you're going to dig and it would record them. I've already put a simple profile in here. You can see it right here. And if you notice, I got the match grade on. So when we're doing a profile, I can come in here and I can step on my pedal. It's going to turn the match grade. It's going to match the grade. And you can see it turns red. This is the first part. Let's say this is a, some kind of swale or something. So as I pull in, once I get to the next point, it's going to put me on the next grade. And then as I go down to the next point, boom, it's going to put me in the next grade, which is the red area. Then I'm going to dig that point. And then when I get to the next point, it goes to the next point keeps going and anytime you go out you let go of the pedal go do your dig swing out dump come back in and anytime you want to match the grade you're at as you get closer and closer to it uh, going down which then you just 
your last grade. You can just sit there and hold the pedal, dig it out, and it'll match the exact grade for you. Uh, this is a great advantage for digging tanks, for digging anything you can't see, for digging profiles of any kind for any kind of machine. Uh, to get out of that, it's real simple. You just hold the button down and just disable profile. Now we're going to talk about x-ray vision. Uh, you see, should have seen that, what we patented, uh, we copyrighted on our, on our software. But we have x-ray vision and now we have machine control. So we have some safeties that we've added and, and it's pretty neat how it works. So I'll just give you a little demonstration here. Um, x-ray vision, you can see we got a fake pipe down there right now. You go in, you touch, you get your pipe set up. You can see our bucket here. Right now we're six inches away at closest. You can see us coming up to it. Starts making noise, beeping, blah, blah, blah. So you can see all around what you're digging, what's going on, where it's at in relationship to this. Well, with machine control, we were scared that someone would hit the pedal and the bucket would turn green and it might turn and turn into the line or something accidentally or hurt somebody down there. So we stopped it at a minimum of one foot away and we can set that distance in if we want, but a standard setting is one foot away. So right now we're one foot six. I'm gonna zoom out. We have the ability to zoom. So this could be a 12 foot pipe or a, a, a size of a hair, a hundredth of an inch. Um, and it's gonna give us the right scale. So, oops. Very simple, get back to x-ray, it's the F3. You can see the bucket now, the angle of the boom, what's going on. Um, you can see that I'm one foot six away at the closest point of my bucket at any point. I push machine control. You can see the bucket is now set to grade, ready to dig. It's green. We're pulling forward, see the bucket adjusting. Very simply adjusting exactly to grade, so you're cutting. Now we're nine inches away. It's still green, but look, no, no machine control, none at all none at all within a foot. Because we don't want to take a chance of someone keeping their foot on the pedal like mine is now. When I let go of the pedal, it turns yellow, turn green, turns on machine control. We don't want that to move near a utility line. So it's very simple. Um, we can zoom right in and set it up. We can also, don't forget, if you want to uh, do simple hookup, you can, when you touch the, touch the line or get too close to it, right before you hit it, it can shut your hydraulics off. You can see how accurate this is. It's, it's amazingly accurate. Machine control. Move our little uh, pipe out of the way here. Come back down and this works on all excavators. It's very simple. Um, it's basically $12,000 with, with uh, we come and do free installation, you pay the travel. And this is a simple machine here, but it's, it is harder to make this dig smooth than any excavator because the excavators use proportional hydraulics. This is what you call bang, bang, it's on off. So I'm gonna turn it on again and you can watch how perfectly this bucket holds grade. No chatter, no shaking, anything, and it shaves perfect grade. Uh, we've changed it. There's a quarter inch of slope so far in that board sitting there. So it's very simple how it works. You come back in again, you hit it, pedal, it drops right to grade. Now your, your bucket on your machine will drop much faster, but you can see definitely how smooth and simple this operates. We've got all kinds of different safeties and all kinds of different ways. Um, and we can set up, we can, we can set it to, we got memories and when they're green, they're in the, in, the, in the thing and you can double click and you can change a memory um, from one to the other. So you can go through routines that way too. So you can dig and set up one bank, double click and it goes to the next memory and you can double click and go to the next memory and go on through and they'll dig those different profiles. So any questions or anything, you can go to www.idigbest.com or you can call us directly, uh, most likely to get me, at 317-210-0220. Thank you very much.